Podcasting is networking. Cafe Networking Podcast promotes entrepreneurs, business experts throughout the world. I'm Tom Riach, known as the king of networking, connecting people and speaking from my studio in Brazil. And today we talk with Gavin Siqueira, and he's joining us from Napperby, South Australia in Australia. Gavin is founder and CEO of Break Free from Corporate Mentoring. He's a speaker, author, and coach. And today, Gavin's mission is all about empowering entrepreneurs to safely transition into their own business without risking their current job or income. Gavin is the author of Break Free from Corporate, Be Your Own Boss. He runs a couple of successful mentoring programs, helping everyday people build and implement their roadmap to freedom. So, Gavin, how did you make the switch from employee to entrepreneur? Thank you, Tom, for having me on your show. Look, it wasn't easy. Uh, I had a, a time when I, you know, I was burnt out in my corporate career. I was in, in uh, the corporate space for about 12 years, and I was successful in that because I was doing all the right things. I, was, I had a team. I was traveling. It was fun. I was getting paid well, but my health started to suffer. My, um, you know, I kind of felt like a fish out of water after a while because it was a lot of politics and mm -hmm. you know the hours were long and this was an area i didn't know how to fix and mm -hmm. the harder i worked the harder they expected me to work and you know you you almost become a slave to the company and while i i have a lot of respect for the corporate industry as right. a whole i needed to get out mm -hmm. i i needed to find a way out and so I'm talking uh, about 16 years ago now, I left the corporate world. And this is before we had, you know, Spotify and before we had YouTube and Facebook and, mm -hmm. and all of that. So, you know, I had to find information just by looking it up on the internet and talking to friends and people. And, you know, I went to seminars, I, I sat down, I read books that would teach me some personal development and, and for me to figure out what I really wanted to do with my life. You know, what right. was important to me? What were my values? Um, and and that really kind of shifted a lot of things for me. It, it got me to think outside the square. Mm -hmm. So the first thing mm -hmm. I did was read a book called Rich Dad, Poor Dad by Robert Kiyosaki. Mm -hmm. And some of your listeners may have heard this book. And, and uh, it changed my life, Tom, right? Because it taught me that you know, I don't have to have all my income coming from one place. Right. The concept that I could have multiple streams of income right. or more than one mm -hmm. was a game changer for me. And then the other one was the fact that I could control an income source or create an income source. I hadn't even thought of that. Right. <laughs> you know, right. and so th th these are, they sound like basic concepts now, but back then this was transformational for me. So that was the no, first but that, thing. That's still real today. When we look at today's world, yeah. that's most people, yeah. are, I don't want to say they're trapped, uh, but they're, mm. in, they're, they're surrounded by their corporate world. Uh, they're involved. No, and right. Corporate worlds are very involving. Oh, very, very, you know, and, uh, you know, for people that have been in a place for 10 years, 20 years, 30 years, you almost become part of the furniture after a while. Mm -hmm. And um, I looked at the guys, you know, the people above me, you know, the managers and, and all that above me. And I, and I thought, I don't want that lifestyle because some of them hadn't seen their kids in years. Right. You know, some of them hadn't you know, going through their second divorce and all, all kinds of issues. And I thought, I want a better lifestyle for myself. Mm -hmm. So if your listeners are listening to this now thinking, you know, I work really hard, but I just want a better life. I want more freedom in my right. life. I want right. more choice. Right. The good news is you can do it. And it's not by just quitting your job and going and doing something else, because that's kind of risky in today's environment. Mm -hmm. What I recommend to people is you, you educate yourself. You learn something about yourself that you could do outside of your job where you can provide value where right. you can make a difference, you can you know, maybe help uh, provide a solution to a problem that exists, whether it's to a bunch of individuals, maybe some companies, whatever it might be. Right. Um, I have all sorts of examples I could share, like teachers who started their own online tutoring programs mm -hmm. where they could help kids online. Right. So I guess one of the things is teaching yourself some skills online, right? Because what's well, all the there, it, it really is, you know, uh, 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 we're able to learn constantly. Yeah. And that's one of the points that I focus on is uh, learn something new every day because there totally. is just so much new every day to learn. That's right. We that's wouldn't right, be dude. talking together if I hadn't learned how to <laughs> podcast. 
Right, right, exactly, exactly. And you know what? It's amazing that the the leaps and bounds that technology have made. Tom, you're aware of this. Um, who knows where we're going to be in the next five years or ten years? It's quite exciting. Right. You know, right. I I saw a statistic. Well, actually, I saw something that said twenty years ago we didn't even have mobile phones. No, right. You know, we didn't. Uh, you know, five a, years amazing. ago we didn't have podcasting platforms. That's the right. only thing That's that right. I'm certain about. Uh, that in five years, it's all going to be different. Uh, and if I don't, you know, uh, involve myself every day with tomorrow, yeah. and that's yeah. tomorrow, uh, I won't be here. I won't be valuable in, in a year. Well, you, you, or you maybe be, a month. <laughs> <laughs> and that's right. So, you know, the, the best thing you can do is if you're not in a position right now where you're, you're, you're satisfied with your lifestyle, you know, you're working too hard, you don't like the boss, or you just want to change, you want to move to a different place, you, want, you just mm -hmm. want more for your kids, for things to change in your world, you have to change. Right. You have to be the catalyst to change. When you can change your mindset, when you can change your education, you can change the thoughts that go through you know, your everyday mind, you can start to take different actions to what you took yesterday. So whatever's happened to get you to this point is, is done. You can't change that. But every day moving forward, you can make different choices. Right. And the choices begin with, you know, just accepting that you want a different life going doing some research and talking to people that maybe they've done things similar that you mm -hmm. want to do find out how they did it learn from them That's listen right. to people like yourself tom right i mean you know how how do people do this stuff you know how, how are the, the the new generation making all this stuff happen so quickly so look you can do it but you need to change who you are yeah, but I agree. It's not all rocket science because many times uh, no. we think, you know, that we, I can't do this because I, I don't know how. And I can assure everybody that if I was able to do it, uh, yeah. everybody can. Uh, I'm That's no right. rocket scientist. I'm, I'm yeah. just a normal guy who has normal intelligence. But yeah. uh, I think the difference came in my case. I needed to, to change. But it was curiosity. Mm. It was, there were things out there happening. And right. If you're, you right. don't follow what's happening, and many people, I said, you know, they, they don't get around their own block. They're in their neighborhood, and they think that's what life's all about. And I'm not saying yeah. that's wrong, uh, but there's a whole world out there. There's opportunities everywhere. What you yeah. do and how you do it, you can offer to anybody anywhere in the world. Well, this is this is the this is the goal that I learned, which is if you can combine the you know your skills and your knowledge and your expertise in such a way that you can provide value to people outside of not not just within your local community but even potentially outside so other states other cities other countries right. you can do this leveraging technology and while it sounds fantastic you're doing it right now talking to me through this podcast right. you know i do it with my clients all around australia and internationally now, if you had t told me, hey, Gavin, could, you know, maybe you'll do this in, in 10 years' time, I would have thought you're joking. Mm -hmm. But that's how quickly things can change. Now, if, like you said, if you can do it and I can do it, your listeners Anybody. definitely can. Because I'm, <laughs> I'm your average guy. I'm no, I'm no smart, smarter than the guy next door. But what I do have is an appetite for knowledge, for learning. I, I, I don't like to think I know it all because I don't. No, well, none of us um, do. There's just too much none to of know. Us do. <laughs> But anyway, no, Gavin, we're, we're coming to the end of our time. How can our listeners sure. find you? Yeah, hundred percent. So, look, I'm on LinkedIn and Facebook. They can they can reach me there. They can go to my website, breakfreefromcorporate.com, mm -hmm. um, and look, you know, reach out that way. We've got plenty of good material. People can just read or listen to or watch. Mm -hmm. I'm on YouTube as well. Um, whatever it takes, get out there and just get in touch. And you know, I look forward to connecting. Just do it. Well, thank you again for just being here. It. Hey, thanks very much, Tom. Okay, and again, for our listeners, just to remind you, it is Gavin Cicada. The first name is G-A-V-I-N, and the last name is S-E-Q-U-E-I-R-A. You can find him on breakfreefromcorporate.com, and you can find him on LinkedIn. Cafe Networking is brought to us by Focus MI Market Intelligence, an agricultural market research specialist in Brazil. More information on their website, focusmi.com. Thanks for listening until the next time here at Cafe and Networking Podcast.